months on the coronavirus. Number of coronavirus. On the coronavirus. This is a crisis. COVID-19 can be characterized as a pandemic. At this point, most of us know about viruses, thanks to COVID-19. But COVID-19 has a mortality rate around 2 to 3%, which means out of 100 people who get infected, 2 to 3 will die. This is an overestimation because most of the cases of COVID-19 are asymptomatic and go unreported. So the real fatality rate of this virus is much, much lower. There's just one virus in the world which has a mortality rate of almost 100%. The name of the virus is rabies virus. The disease caused by this virus is called rabies. Only 14 people have ever survived rabies and before 2003, no one had ever survived rabies. And it's not an easy death. It's one of the worst deaths you can imagine. Rabies has been known since around 2000 BC. The virus is present in every continent except Antarctica. Bats are primary reservoirs of rabies on all inhabited continents. Rabies is transmitted through the bite of an infected animal like a dog, raccoon, or a skunk. Rabies is easily transmitted if the saliva of the infected animal comes into contact with the eyes, mouth, or nose. It is estimated that one person dies from the disease every 15 minutes and more than 300 others are exposed. The bite of a bat is so small that you might just ignore it as a scratch. Rabies virus doesn't travel through blood, so blood tests to detect rabies are futile. The virus multiplies along nervous system, doing virtually no damage and is completely undetectable by the immune system. Initially, the infected person will literally show no symptoms. The virus enters the nerves and from there moves towards spinal cord. The ultimate target of this virus is brain. After a few days, the infected person will show very mild symptoms like a slight headache, tingling sensation on body or nausea. At this point, the person is certainly going to die. As soon as the first symptoms appear, even a miracle won't be able to save the person. There is no cure or treatment for rabies. It generally takes 3 to 10 days for the first symptoms to appear, but it could even take months. It all depends on how close the site of exposure is to the brain. The headache turns into a fever and a general feeling of being unwell. As the virus finds a vast network of nerve endings, it begins to rapidly reproduce, starting at the base of the brain. The person becomes scared and horrified. This is because the virus is chewing up the amygdala. As the virus keeps destroying amygdala, the person becomes hydrophobic. The infected person becomes intensely afraid of water. Despite being extremely thirsty, the person can't drink and every time the person tries, their throat shuts down. At this point, doctors use IV to deliver fluids to the patient. The person starts drooling uncontrollably. The rabies virus always looks for ways to spread itself, therefore it makes the person drool and transmits itself to the salivary glands. Hydrophobia is another defense mechanism of this virus as drinking water would cause saliva to be ingested making the transmission less likely. With the hippocampus long under attack, the person would start having trouble remembering things, especially family. The patient begins hearing things or not hearing at all. At this point, the patient is alone, hallucinating, thirsty, confused, and absolutely terrified. Eventually, the person slips into the dumb rabies phase where the process of brain shutdown starts because so much of it has been turned to liquid. Within 72 hours of this, the patient dies and no one can do anything to save the patient. In 2003, Gina Gizzi, a teenage girl from Wisconsin, became the first human to ever survive rabies. The doctors put her into medically induced coma, which stopped the virus from reaching her brain and bought her immune system enough time to recognize and fight the virus. This treatment is known as the Milwaukee Protocol. While this treatment has been tried multiple times more, 
there have been no further cases of survival. After recovering from coma, she had to learn to walk and talk again. Rabies is totally preventable by vaccines. The rabies vaccine is 100% effective if given within 12 hours post-exposure. In the US, it is recommended to receive one dose of human rabies immunoglobulin and four doses of rabies vaccine over a 14-day period post-exposure. India has the highest rate of human rabies in the world, primarily because of stray dogs. An estimated 20,000 people die every year from rabies in India, more than a third of the global total. Due to a high public awareness of the virus and efforts at vaccination of domestic animals, incidence of rabies in humans is very rare in the United States. From 1960 to 2018, a total of 125 human rabies cases were reported in the U.S. Very few cases of rabies are reported annually in the developed world. The U.K. has been free of rabies since 1905. Rabies is a really big fear of mine, but it still doesn't scare me as much as Amy Schumer trying to do comedy. <laughs>